you may be able to claim a financial benefit called universal credit if you're of working age and unemployed or on a low income. Your savings have to be below a certain level for you to qualify. You may be unable to work because of an illness or disability or due to your caring responsibilities. You can check the Carers UK website to see if you qualify or seek further guidance from one of our advisors. If you have a partner with whom you live, you would usually need to make a joint claim. You would both need to meet the eligibility criteria and all your income and savings would be considered. If you've both reached state pension age and have a low income, you should consider a benefit called pension credit instead. If you decide to apply for universal credit, try to provide as much detail as possible. Universal credit is paid at different rates depending on your age and if it's a joint or single claim. There may also be top-up payments available to you depending on your circumstances. For example, if you have caring responsibilities. In England, Wales and Northern Ireland, it's usually paid every month. In Scotland, it may be paid twice a month. See the Carers UK website for more details and the current rates. Universal credit is replacing older benefits, such as income support and housing benefit. Rather than making a new claim for one of these, you might be asked to apply for universal credit instead. It's a good idea to arrange a benefits check if you're unsure. If you claim universal credit, you may be expected to have regular appointments with a work coach or attend a health assessment. As a carer, you may not have to seek work, but this will depend on your situation and what's agreed with your work coach. There is more detail on the responsibilities that accompany Universal Credit on the Carers UK website. If someone has a terminal illness, there are special rules that apply that can mean that their application is fast-tracked and paid at the highest rate. If you need some help with this, you can always contact a Carers UK advisor for support. If your situation changes when you're claiming universal credit, it's important to report this as soon as possible. You can call the Universal Credit Helpline or record any changes online. Relevant changes might include finding or finishing paid employment, your rent going up or down, moving house or starting to care for someone new. If you'd like to find out more, there is lots more information and guidance on our website, carersuk.org, or you can email advice at carersuk.org. Whatever you're going through, we're always here to help.